We're at Hobnob. I'm here with Marlon Hall, and we're going to do something a little bit different today. We're, they're called mocktails. So it's a cocktail, but we're taking out the alcohol because right now it's hot outside and it's a nice way to have a refreshing drink. So what do we have on tap today? Uh, we'll be making the pomegranate no hito. No hito. No hito. No oh, alcohol, yeah. no hito. All right, so what's all in there? So we'll start with the main ingredient, pomegranate juice. One ounce of that. One ounce. And this, this is, is a good uh, idea, right? If you're hanging out by the pool or something like that, maybe you don't want the alcohol, you have to drive, or maybe you're watching the kids. Absolutely, it's nice absolutely. To be responsible, but still have the, the flavor of spring and summer. Then we'll go for an ounce of cranberry juice. Pomegranate juice is on the sweeter side. Cranberry is a little more stringent, a little more tart. Uh, next, we'll go with half an ounce of ginger. Of ginger. Puree. And what's the flavor of ginger? I know it sounds odd because you cook with it, you drink it, but what exactly? Ginger adds a lot of spice to the cocktail, so it, it cleanses the palate a little bit more. Okay. Does it help bring out the other flavors that you just mix? It in does. There? All of those flavors uh, combine to make a really balanced cocktail. And finally, we'll finish that off with one ounce of lime juice, and we'll take our fresh mint here. Uh, mint is a pretty hearty herb. You don't really need to over manipulate it. If you do, it would become bitter. Odd question, do they sell mint everywhere? Because when I'm shopping for produce, I usually don't take time to go they in do. the mint section. Absolutely, they do? yeah. Right. Pretty pretty easy to, to come by. And then you just um, throw it in there? Just oh, throw it in there. It. It's really yep. strong. You yeah. don't need to muddle it. Um, some places do, but we, you don't need to. Give that a good shake. You want to shake it awake? Shake and wake. Shake it awake. <laughs> Add some ice. And then we will strain into our glass. Well, that looks really good. Now, Marlon, one of your jobs here, you actually create a lot of these drinks, correct? Absolutely. Um, as part of the task of a bar manager, you come up with the cocktail program. And what's that like then? Like, like where do you get your... Uh, your ideas from? Um, the seasons uh, are very inspirational for us. So we take a lot of cues from, from our kitchen and from the, the chef team. I know we were over here a couple weeks ago, and whatever was in this was a fan <laughs> favorite. What was this? This is the uh, Unitiki Plaza. Uh, it's one of our <laughs> signature cocktails here. It's a rum-based cocktail with lots of tropical uh, Polynesian-inspired. And one ingredients. thing that's really cool about Hobnob is this bar amazing. Like this bar is amazing here, but also this, there's a lounge area right here, and then the restaurant on the other side. It's got great food, great drinks. That is really good. Really refreshing. It's really refreshing, yeah. And it's very easy to incorporate rum into that and make it a pomegranate mojito. Um, have it leaded with the mojito. Absolutely, absolutely. And then you guys have happy hour here. We do, uh, Monday through Friday. Uh, we have $4 select uh, beer and wine, $2 off of our draft cocktails. And Friday and Saturday, we have a late night happy hour that starts at 10 and goes to oh, midnight. Wow. And then the website? Uh, it's hobnobwithus.com. Hobnobwithus.com. All right, Marlon, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm going to have My another pleasure. sip. Absolutely. We'll be back right after this.